What's going on, everybody? Hello, Facebook. Welcome to another episode of Mind Your Business. My name is Ken Cloutier of GetMotivatedForSuccess.com. I live down in Fort Lauderdale, Florida. And what I do is I teach entrepreneurs and network marketers how to generate more leads for their business, sponsor more reps, and make more money. Um, and what I wanted to do, I actually wanted to address um, something that uh, somebody had. And actually, let me just invite a couple people here. I wanted to invite some groups. Um, but what I wanted to do was address uh, something that uh, some folks had asked me um, that I'm working with about videos. And their, their whole concern was they're getting a lot of, well, I shouldn't say a lot. They were getting some people, you know, that were um, on their videos. You know, they were doing some Facebook lives, and you know, they were getting haters. They were getting haters. They were getting people that were saying, "Oh, you know, you have a big forehead," or, you know, "Is that your real hair?" You know, stupid things, right? Clowning on about you know, network marketing or MLM business, and oh, that stuff doesn't work, and all that kind of crap. Right? Sorry, I'm just sharing some stuff here. Just give me a couple seconds. Share, share, share. Hold on a second, I'm sorry. Just want to share. The problem is you can't go live and then share at this or before. So I just wanted to share a couple different groups. But I wanted to, to really talk to you about haters, man. Because you know what? Haters going to hate. Haters are going to hate. And, you know, there's there's nothing you can do. Haters are just there. They're, they're the people that, you know, they want to, they, their life sucks, so they want to hate on other people that are doing something. And you're going to get haters. Let's just, let's just be real. Let's just keep it real. Keep it 100, right? You're going to get haters. If you're doing anything worthwhile you're gonna have people that are not going to like you they're not gonna like what you're doing they're going to um, you know put down what you're doing they're just gonna hate right it's like crabs in a barrel have you ever seen have you ever heard the analogy where there's two crabs in a barrel and you know one crab would be able to get out one crab would actually be able to get out but what happens is if you put two crabs in a barrel, then they're going to keep, every time the one crab starts to get out, the other crab pulls them down. And it's like, it's, it's known. This is a known thing. It's like scientifically proven, right? That if you put two crabs in a, bear, uh, in a bucket, none of them will get out because they'll just keep pulling the other one down. And you have to understand, that's what people do, you know, that are, that are haters is they they want to pull you down they they feel that you know if you are trying to do something that they don't have the balls excuse my my language but if you don't have the balls if they don't have the balls to do it they want to bring you down because what happens is when you start to succeed and you're doing stuff that they're afraid to do it it doesn't help them justify the fact that they're not doing something. They're not starting their own business. They're not, you know, going live on Facebook because they're scared. They're too worried about what, what other people think, what other people think. So, you know, what I told these folks is, hey, listen, guys, haters are going to hate. Haters are going to hate. So you have to get over the fact that you're going to have people that are going to diss you. They're going to make fun of you. They're going to laugh. They're going to snicker. They're going to talk behind your back. It is what it is. That's the price of success. That's why you know, success isn't easy. That's why you have to learn to become bulletproof, right? You have to learn to just take what they say and just toss it to the side. Who cares? Who cares what they think? Who cares what they say? The only people that you should care about are the people that are helping you get to where you want to get to. It's the only people that you should care about. You shouldn't care about if, you know, if your, your friends laugh at you, you shouldn't care if your family members are laughing at you. You shouldn't care if a stranger is laughing at you. Because you know the one thing that has always helped me um, overcome any sort of you know self-doubt if somebody is 
hating on me or saying something is I think to myself, are any one of those people going to pay my bills? Are any one of those people going to pay my bills? The answer is no. Who gives a rip what they think? Who cares what they think? They're not paying your bills, guys. Why do you care what they think? Now, you know, as humans, we, we obviously we want to fit in. We want people to like us. That's natural. But you have to learn to grow a backbone. You have to put. You have to become bulletproof to where, you know, if somebody says something negative about you or says something, you know, about your video or about your business, you have to have the attitude of I don't care. I don't care. I mean, think about this. Think about this. I love this. This. You know, you've probably heard it too. It's a saying. I don't even know who said it. It's just a saying that's stuck. It's kind of like listed under the principles, but there's never been a statue. There's never been a statue erected for critics. There's never been a statue that's been erected to the critic. Here, you know, here is a statue. Here's a monument to the biggest critic ever. Here is a monument to somebody that said it wouldn't work, and it never would work. We're raising a statue for them. No. Who do they erect statues to? People that have accomplished something. People that went against the grain. People that did it despite. People that did it under the circumstances. People that faced adversity and still did it anyway. That's who they raise the statues to. They don't raise the statues to the critics. So if you're doing, you know, uh, Facebook lives, if you're getting people that are, you know, hating on your business, they're hating on your dreams, they're hating on your ambition, they're hating on your entrepreneurship, why are you erecting a statue for them? Let them go. Let them hate. Let them say stupid things. You know what you can do on Facebook, which I love? You can hit the block button, right? You can make it so they can't go on your page ever again. Just block them. Who cares, right? All you have to do Hit, the, hit a couple buttons, just say, oh, I don't like what you're saying, boom, lock them, done. That's it. That's it. Don't give life to the haters. Don't give life to people that are going to disrespect you. Don't give life to the people that are putting you down. Focus on the people that are supporting you. Focus on your mentors. Focus on your coaches. Focus on the people that are in agreement, are in line with what your goals and dreams are. That's who you focus on. Put the blinders on, right? Put the blinders on. And just remember that no statue has ever been erected to somebody that is a critic. The negative Nancys, the nasty Nicks, right, out there, who cares? And I know it's easier said than done, but you gotta, if you wanna succeed, guys, in your business, you have to become bulletproof. You have to get to the point where the opinions of other people that are not helping you get to where you want to go to, don't matter, right? Don't be snyamped, susceptible to the negative influences of other people, snyamped. Don't get snyamped. And there's people out there that their whole goal is to literally get on, get on Facebook, get on Twitter, get on whatever, and they want to diss you. They want to put you down. Right? They want to ruin your dream. Now, you're going to let some idiot that you don't even know that's a keyboard hulk. Right? I call them keyboard hulks. They're, they're, big and, they're big and burly behind the keyboard, but they're never going to say something to your face. Right? Are you going to let somebody like that ruin your goals and your dreams? Are you going to let somebody like that keep you from doing a Facebook Live because you're worried about what that person said, their opinion? Who cares? Who cares? I know I'm being a little raw, but that stuff rubs me the wrong way because I can't stand people that put people's goals and dreams down. Man, why can't we just support people and say, hey, great job on the video, you know, awesome video. Hey, I'm, I'm excited that you're pursuing something else, right? I'm excited that you have the guts to do something different than 98% of the other people out there. Why can't people just, just be supportive? And if you... But if you get somebody that's not supportive, if you get somebody that's nasty, hey guys, put the put the hater blockers on, right? Put the I wish I had some sunglasses right now. I'd put the hater blockers on. Why? Because you can't see the haters. You can't see the haters. All you can see are the people, your fans, the people that watch your videos, the people that support you. That's all you should focus on. 
giving value to the people that want your value, not the idiots that are gonna, you know, all they're doing is they're creepers. They're just like going to different videos and they're going on people's pages and just saying all kinds of negative stuff. Who cares? Who gives a rip? Haters gone hate. Haters gone hate. Okay? So remember that, guys. Put the blockers on. Put the hater blockers on. Focus on where you're going. Focus on what you want to accomplish. And don't worry about any of the haters. Man, don't even give them life. Because once they figure out that you can't be shaken, they're like bullies, right? They're like online bullies. When they realize that you can't be shaken, that no matter what they say, you don't give it life, you don't even acknowledge it, <laughs> deuces, they're off. They're going to go to somebody else. So don't let them pick on you. Don't let them, don't let them dictate what you do for your business. Don't let them dictate if you do a video or not. Just because you get a couple people that say something negative. Who cares? Keep it moving. Keep it moving. So haters going to hate. You keep it moving. Put the hater blockers on. And you will be A-OK. -okay. Now, for those of you that um, would like to you know, get some more training on how you can fast track your business, how you can make a six-figure income, um, my buddy Todd Falcone did an awesome training. And he actually talks about attitude a little bit. He talks about you know, how you're going to have to build your business despite people not believing in you. That you're going to have to build your business despite people not agreeing with what you're doing. You're going to have to build your business and overcome some of these self-limiting beliefs that you have. Um, he did a, a training that teaches you the mindset and the activity on how to fast track your business. So if you're interested in checking out that video, I left the link. It's either, I don't know, it's above, well, wrong hand. It's above or below the video. And um, it's going to teach you how to fast track your business, how to make six figures in your business. So if you want to get it, you can, you can grab it right here. Um, click the link. It's getmotivatedforsuccess.com forward slash fast track. Getmotivatedforsuccess.com forward slash fast track. And you can get it right here. Um, just have to you know, put your name and information in and you'll get access to the free training on how to fast track your way to six figures in your business. So go ahead and grab that. Feel free to share this with anybody that you think could get value from this. You know, some of your teammates, maybe you've had a situation where um, you know, one of your teammates got some flack, got some negative, nasty feedback from somebody. Show them this video. Show them this video. Because listen, guys, haters going to hate, and you just got to keep it moving. So I enjoy sharing with you guys. Hope you got some great value from this. Um, and I'm going to be on again tomorrow night at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Mark your calendars. Um, make sure you click the notification button. Or if you're seeing me for the very first time, go over to Get Motivated for Success on Facebook. Like my page and click the notification button so that you get notified when I go live. I go live Monday through Friday at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, and the the broadcast and I do a um, uh, a hashtag mind your business, mind your business because that's what you want to do is keep your mind on your business. All right. So with that guys, this is Ken Cloutier of GetMotivatedForSuccess.com down in Fort Lauderdale, Florida. Have an awesome day. Go ahead and grab that free training, guys. It's awesome. Peace out. Have an awesome night. Take care. Oh, and happy Valentine's Day to everybody out there in love. Happy Valentine's Day. I got to get home to my wife before she doesn't love me anymore. So with that said, deuces. Have a happy Valentine's Day. Take care. Bye for now.